Where is he? Come on, Sam. Dear McKenna, sorry I can't be there this week, but I'm on a family vacation in Gotham City. Luckily though, I got you the next best thing, track star, Zach Geyer, to fill in for me. Time of the morning! Alright, let's get started then. Let's start off strong with women's lacrosse who got their first two wins of the season with combined scores of 36 goals while only letting six goals cross through the net. I can't even count that high. Literally. Goals from Zoe Chirumbolo McKee, <laughs> Cecilia Critchfield, <laughs> the Daisy herself, Katie Wise. Let's go, I love daisies. Jessica Flick, Grace Kennedy, Kelly Mamula, Hannah Fetter, and Tavia Horn. And last but not least, my very own daughter, the howling and growling Maya Wolf. Oh! <laughs> Next on the agenda, men's and women's track and field hosted the NCAC championships here in the steamer this past weekend with the men posting a third place finish and the women posting a sixth place finish. The men were led by a four by two team consisting of Matthew Droblet, Rashawn Edwards, Jack Houck, and an insane finish comeback win from Matthew Rogers as well. Woo! Matthew Droblik also PR'd in both his 60 meter dash and 200 meter dash where he posted third place finishes in both earning him all NCAC rewards. Connor Kolka also earned third place finishes in the 3K and the 5K. Devin Ramsey, grandpa himself, broke his own record in the 800 meter. Jeez. And Justin Norris, he's a freshman, posted a second place finish in high jump with an insane jump competition against Max Bickler. Let's go! On the women's side, Lindsay Magato posted a second place finish in the 60 and a second place finish in the 200 meter. Woo. Karen Turkovich also took a third place finish in the 5K, breaking the school record Woo. as well. Woo. The women's 4 by 2 team also consisting of Reese Nurmeyer, Megan Frazier, Kingston Collins, and Mags again, Woo. posted a third place finish, and Hannah Schartz, Mrs. Volleyball herself, posted a third place finish in the women's high jump. Let's go! <laughs> Emma Hellman making a big splash for swimming that, and I mean huge, by placing first at regionals in the women's three meter dive. Wow! With a total score of 448.50. It's a lot of numbers. And also advancing to the NCAA championships, which will be held at IUPUI in Indianapolis beginning on March 16th. Now time for some bump, set, and spike action with men's volleyball. Taking on Marion from Wisco, Wisconsin. Jack Boone with a monstrous 17 kills and then going all the way to four sets against Trine. We had Russell Burke with count it 12 kills Woo. and Aaron Georgie with a total of 63 assists between two games. 62. Two. Do it like this, not this. Two games. Women's water polo going 3-0 on the week. Taking down all three opponents by scores up 16 to 12, <laughs> 10 to 8, <laughs> and finally 15 to 8. <laughs> Coming off this three-game win streak, the Tigers are now 2-0 in conference play. Remember, right here. In order to cure my seasonal depression of the MLB lockout, we had Wittenberg men's baseball this weekend going 2-0 once yeah. again. They opened their season with a doubleheader against John Carroll University from my Cleveland area. We don't need to talk about them though. Winning both games. Gabe Stacy had an insane walk-off in the first game with the bases loaded. Started his season out hot with an insane performance, like I said, which earns him NCAC Athlete of the Week honors, Woo. as well as a home run Woo. in his first at bat. Woo. Went on to the second game against John Carroll. Austin Luther pitched it an insane game with Eight, count it, eight strikeouts. Also Ooh. earning him NCAC Athlete of the Week honors. Now, what you've all been waiting for, talk of the town, drum roll please, women's basketball! Ooh, 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 ooh. Knocking out the fake Tigers of DePaul, 
in the NCAC semifinals with a score of 55 to 52. Insane game. My girl Jade Simpson with a double double with 12 points and 11 rebounds, which brought us to the championship game <laughs> against Owu, where we pulled out the championship, nail biting dub, winning 64 58 in overtime. Oh, let's go. Again, Jade Simpson with the double digit rebounds. 13. Insane. Fish. Christy Kalos with 18 points and also achieving tournament MVP honors. <laughs> and Abigail, yunky dunk yunker <laughs> with 13 points and seven rebounds, also earning all tournament team honor. Well done, Grandma. Woo. And lastly, an amazing performance from my PG1, Delaney Williams, who between the two games tallied up 19 points and 11 assists. Go, 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 let's go. I could not be more proud of my team, and we would all like to say thank you to all of our Tiger family, you included, for all of your support. And now it's time to go dancing. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> We're going whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? What? Who are you, who are you playing? We're, all right, all right. We're going to Hope College in Michigan, Holland, Michigan, yeah. and we're playing Marietta on Friday at 5 p.m. Got it, 5 p.m. Mark it down, mm -hmm. write it down, live Be it, love there. it, it. Be there, if you're not there, watch it online. Let's go! Come on! Woo! <laughs> okay. Like I said, one thing. <laughs>